Good evening. We begin tonight with a shuttered school building in the Erie School District. Erie's public school directors will meet Wednesday to decide the fate of Erie's Roosevelt Middle School. And some are saying get rid of it. Others asking if it can be repurposed at all. Samir Nefsi joins us outside the old middle school after speaking with neighbors. Samir? Sean and Joe, good evening to you. Yeah, so Wednesday's meeting, the board is expected to vote on a company to come in and perform asbestos field work. Now, that needs to be done before the possible demolition can move forward here at Roosevelt Middle School. It used to be a beautiful middle school. They had uh, nice tennis courts, a nice basketball uh, court for the kids to play in, and now it's just a huge eyesore. Philip Benucci recalls attending Roosevelt in the late 70s. He says after years of sitting vacant and not well maintained, it has become a problem in the neighborhood with people breaking into it. Another neighbor who taught at the school says he wishes more could be done with the building. I wish it could be remodeled. I wish it could be something effective for our beautiful community in this neighborhood. But I also know the reality of time and, and she's an old building and there's been a lot of wear and tear on her. After closing the middle school's doors in 2007, the building went on sale for four years with not one prospective buyer reaching out. The school district initially hoped for someone to purchase the building and possibly repurpose it. However, after last year's fire, they decided that was no longer an option. We feel that the land is actually more valuable without the building on it. And so at this point, the building has gone beyond any repair. At this point, the building is more of a hazard to have up. The director of operations for the school district says the estimate for demolishing the building is $850,000. The building will more than likely be taken down pending the results of the asbestos survey. I think this is something that will make the uh, neighborhood better. And yes, we understand that there is emotional ties to the building. Work on tearing down Roosevelt could begin as early as late summer. Many wondering what's going to happen at Ainsworth Good, which is just behind the uh, middle school behind me, but that is actually part of a uh, subdivided part that is not actually up for demolition, just like the middle school right behind me. Now, for uh, updates on the building, what's going to happen Wednesday, you can always stick with us on air and online at yourerie.com. We'll be sure to bring you the latest there. Sean? Samir Nafsi reporting live on the west side tonight. Thanks, Samir.